Hi, it's Richard. Um, I've not been on uh, video for some time now, several months, and um, felt like I should try and give you some explanation. Uh, it's a, a whole combination of factors, and um, it'll all become a lot clearer over time. Um, lots of things going on with brands that I sell through the year that have been um, not particularly positive, and it's been a bit of an eye-opener in terms of having any kind of social media uh, like this, like any kind of outlet, I have to be incredibly careful about what I say, when I say it, how I say it, and making sure that people I work with don't get affected. Um, people, you know, and suppliers, you know, it's important to keep working with people um, through thick and thin, you know. So, um, yeah, I've been incredibly busy, uh, but there's been a lot of things going on, um, some of which I documented even last year, as you know, with the g &L thing, uh, that little saga uh, rumbles on and all will become obviously a lot clearer over time. So, um, but, so, however, really, so it's a combination of one, not wanting to sit on here looking all depressed and moaning about stuff and upsetting people in the process, but also um, the time the time it takes to prepare and do all these videos when I am just so <laughs> ridiculously busy all the time. Um, so I want to give you kind of a real life um, look at, I mean, for example, if I was doing a video, I'd probably want to sit there, I decided, when I was doing them, preparing them properly. But you know, look, this is what my room is full of at the moment. Just, I don't know if you can see that, but just boxes uh, of stuff. And, um, you know more boxes here and then there's boxes through here where i'd want to talk to you about stuff um and then in the office here ooh, hello so in the office we just boxes and stuff so so the the um where are we oh i don't know there's no real no real pleasant background to work with um so i'm going to do a lot more of this kind of thing i'm going to i bought a new another new camera this is a, uh, I think this is a Samsung, latest Samsung camera. It's got a quite a decent little um, sort of stop. No, it doesn't doesn't vibrate too much when I'm holding it. I've got a little um, hand, a little. Um, you know, I can't stand looking at that background. Let me let me at least try and have some guitars behind me. Here we go. Um, I've got a little tripod, and I'm just gonna, as new exciting things come in, I'm gonna go back to how I started. Just off off the cuff, things are happening. And just I'll give you updates because genuinely that's that's where the best stuff happens. Um, there's been so many moments where I've just wanted to show you something, and I can't because I have to prepare it. I have to get the camera out. Uh, I have to wire up a damn microphone. I've had all the problems with microphones working, and I'm just not that environment. It's just not. I'm not a slick um, marketing company. Uh, I am a guy, you know, here loving what I'm doing with guitars and um, so if I can kind of just put that across a bit better that's how I'm going to do it just just um, so there we go um, I'm not going to start telling you about stuff right now even though for example these fun and funky little uh, guitars oh my god that's amazing so is it you this is a great example look this is a uh, an acoustic and electric um, dual voice Italia guitar that I uh, that I want to tell you about at some point, which is truly uh, extraordinary on lots of levels. The fun Dan Electro stuff I've been doing um, because the sound that you get out of these things is completely unique and they're fun. And I thought it brings color. Twelve string. This is a genuine sound. That's a genuine. It doesn't look like it, but it's painted in black in there. Um, so this is a, a beautiful electric 12 string. That's the nicest sounding 12 string I've heard as an electric guitar. These are all, these are all things that are happening all the time. Um, but I, um, and obviously there's all sorts of, uh, look at this. <laughs> there's just a whole world of new little developments that are going on. This is the Art and Luthery, um, guitars with the washed, this is a washed denim finish. Uh, so it, oh, look. Beautiful. <laughs> my Gordon Smith. So this is what I want to be doing. Oh my God, look. Apart from the mandolin, which I haven't been talking to you about mandolins. Obviously it's not my area, but, but they're Eastman. Uh, and they're just just beautiful. But that's what I really wanted to show you. Another um, SB59 waiting to uh, be snapped up. Then of course, look, over here. 
See, I can do it all in one go, you see. I've got a camera in my hand. I can just do it in one go. Uh, I'm just going to give a quick roundup. Fret King. This is incredibly important. This is talking about... Um, Fret King is going to fit into this whole time. I will be doing a big thing on this. Fret King are incredibly important. But if you look at that one model, uh, somewhere there, uh, it's, it's in selfie mode, so it's not going to... It's, it's trying to focus on my, my face, but um, it's... Um, that's an extraordinary guitar. It's like a three, um, an American deluxe Strat at a fraction of the price. I'll be talking about that. Noiseless pickups on a single coil Strat style guitar. Lagerback, really nice designs. Uh, really affordable electroacoustics. People looking for affordable stuff. Um, so anyway, it goes on and on and on. I'll speak to you soon. And um, this is the new way I'm going to be presenting stuff. As stuff happens, I'll. Uh, I'll bring it on the camera here and uh, I look forward to seeing you soon. Okay, bye. See you soon.